Hello and welcome back to another episode of Foxy No Tales Minecraft Adventures here inside of my survival world. And today is the last day that I'm going to be working on my shop. And I'm sure you're all cheering because the last episode was the redstone episode and it was... Uh, yeah, it was hard work, let's put it that way. Uh, so today, uh, we're going to finish off. And I've done all the redstone outside of the video, so you don't have to worry about any of that today. All we're going to be doing today is uh, just making it look rather nice. So I'm just going to grab a few things out of here. Of course, I'm going to add somebody to my tree of life. Um, I'm just trying to think what other things I might need for the shop. But I don't think there's a great deal of stuff in here, to be honest. So let's go and add somebody to my tree of life. And then let's get cracking with finishing off the shop shop uh, because I want to get this done so let's go out of this door today I don't go out of this door very often uh, why not and let's head over here jump 360 almost uh, down here and today I am going to be adding uh, swaggy dude nine banter no <laughs> there we go and the reason I'm adding swaggy dude nine banter is because he said you're the best Minecraft YouTuber. And I, I I like the sound of that. That sounds very nice to me. I, I'm sure I'm probably not, but uh, he seems to think I am. So he deserves a place on my tree of life. And if you want to get on my tree of life, all you've got to do is send me something nice. Uh, maybe add a nice comment into the comment section or post something on my Facebook page or Twitter account. And you may just well end up find yourself on my tree of life if you want to get on there anyway. Um, so yeah. You can see through the windows of the shop that I've uh, I've done lots of painful redstone outs on the video. Uh, I'll have a quick nip down into here so you can see it in all of its glory. And while I'm down here, I'm also just going to stick a few torches around because I really don't want anything uh, spawning in here once we've got the rest of the shop finished. Um, so yeah, let's just do that and let's put a couple around here as well. Just make sure it's nice and bright so, uh, so we don't get any nasty baddies down here uh, upsetting everything. So that should be nice and bright. And, uh, yeah, it looks complicated. It's probably more complicated than it needs to be, but it was the only way I could figure out how to do it. And basically what happens is you put something in one of those chests, they travel through the hoppers, go through the droppers and end up into the dispensers. And this is just a clock to basically make it repeat a few times so that the items definitely make it all the way from the hoppers to the dispensers. Uh, and I'll show you how that works uh, the easiest possible way. Let's say, for instance, I put a sword in there and I put a pickaxe in there and I put a spare uh, axe in there and a spade in there it'll start clicking any minute now there we go one two three four five six and then I've got a sword in there a pickaxe in there and a spade in there and an axe in there so basically I'm going to be putting um, armor in those and uh, using those as armor dispensers but we want to make it look rather nice and pretty in here as well. So we're going to do that. We're going to put a door on the changing room here. Like, no, no, not there. On here, like this. And we're going to use some paintings to cover up those dispensers because we don't want to look like we're going into uh, something that's going to shoot us with arrows. We want it to look like a nice changing room uh, that, uh, yeah, we're going into a shop to get changed. So let's pop a painting on there, one on there, one on there, and one on there. We don't want that one on there. We want a nice long one on there that's going to cover them both. There we go, one like that, and that looks quite good for a changing room anyway, and that looks like quite good for a changing room as well, so that's perfect. And then we want some item frames, uh, which I have 13 of them, that's more than enough. I'm gonna put one there, one there, one there, and one there, and we're gonna put our armor in those. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna nip very quickly to my house and grab some spare armor. Hopefully I've got some spare armor kicking around, and before I do that, I'm just gonna put this door here, that's how we get into the shop. Let's go and get some spare armor and we can uh, decide then which one's going to be helmets and chest plates and trousers and boots and I should have some spare armor kicking around in one of these in fact I know where I've got some spare armor I have spare armor in my spare tools and armor ch oh I know I don't I thought I did uh, okay well we'll make some then what have we got plenty of I'm sure we got plenty of iron we normally got loads of iron there we go we've got loads of iron look let's make a, a couple of sets of iron armor and we'll use it as an iron ar armor dispenser for now so we'll have one uh, two helmets like that we'll have two pairs of leggings like that we will have two pairs of boots like that and we'll have two chest plates 
like oh look at that and I've just got the perfect amount of uh, iron as well to do that the reason I've made two of everything is because one set's going to go in the dispensers and one set's going to go on the item frame so we know which one to put them back in um, not that it makes much difference but we want to make sure we're putting the right ones back in the right dispensers I'm just getting rid of that uh, bit of grass there so uh, let's head in here and figure out which chest goes where so if I put a helmet in there which dispenser is that going to come out of? So we'll put that on there. So that should then, oh, I need to take the paintings off actually quickly in here so I can figure out where it's going. That's going into, oh, I need to wait for the clicks. Any minute now, the clicks. Have I broken it? Oh no, don't tell me I've broken it. Okay, we'll put uh, boots in there, perhaps. Maybe, there we go, now it's clicking. So obviously I, the re redstone on that one doesn't just appear to be working too well. So uh, boots have come out there, which is perfect. So we'll put leggings in this one here and they should come out in uh, that top one there. And we'll put, uh, in fact, we'll change that. We'll put that in there and we'll put the chest plate on that one there and we'll stick the chest plate in there and uh, let's get our hat back out of there oh no that was in the right one it doesn't matter it doesn't matter which one it goes in so let's uh, wait for those to all get in the dispensers where they should be so there should be trousers in there yes there are and boots in there come on come on start clicking away i don't seem to have wired this side up correctly let me just go and see if i can fathom out what the problem is here uh the redstone comes down there. Uh, uh, the, the comparators are on, so they should be doing something. Um, let's have a look. See, those ones are off, so that turns that redstone torch on. So those comparators are off, so that, that redstone torch should be off, you see. So have I put the repeaters down the wrong way? Oh, I know what I've forgotten to do. Doop, I know what I've forgotten to do. I didn't finish my redstone circuit and I told you I wouldn't be doing redstone in today's video. I'm sorry about that. I only need three pieces. Three pieces of redstone is all it takes. Uh, let's grab that and let's get some uh, dirt with so we can pile up as well. Uh, and let's just throw my spade down there uh, because why not? <laughs> and let's, uh, let's just hop through here and see if we can build across to there to save piling up and there we go so if i pop 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 like that there we go that will work now hopefully he says ow so it should start clicking any minute there we go it's clicking it's clicking and it does make my game really laggy when it starts going but i think that's just because of the sheer amount of redstone and droppers and hoppers and things in there so i should have now a chest plate in there and a hat in there so uh, let's just have something to eat quickly Yum, 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 yum. Nice tasty bread. Uh, there we go. Let's take my armor off. Let's put my hat in there and my chest plate in there and my trousers in there and my shoes in there. And then we'll go inside and we will see what armor we get. Because dispensers are random, we'll get a mix probably of uh, iron and diamond. So we'll shut the door and we'll go in and we'll press the button. Beep. So now we should be fully dressed. There we go. And we got all of the diamond back except for the hat. So uh, let's go get my hat back. Which one was that in? That was in there. There we go. And uh, let's swap that one back. And let's put the hat back in there and prepare for the lug. And when we can put the pictures back up as well. So uh, yeah, one. Oh, okay. We'll have a tall one and those there. That's fine. That's absolutely fine. And hopefully the lag will stop in a second. I don't think I'll be using this shop much with all that lag. Right. So now we're going to make the front of the shop pretty. We're going to need some armor stands and we're going to need some wool. And we're going to make the front of the shop very advertising. So we're probably going to need some more armor as well to put in there. Oh, I don't want to open that. The sheep will escape. We want some light blue wool and we would like some green wool. Uh, we'll go for, yeah, normal green wool and uh, we also want some stained glass so do we want stained glass or do we want normal glass i might just go for normal glass um because so then you'll be able to see inside better and what i'm going to do is just the, the shop windows at the front of the shop so you can uh, see what you're buying so let's head this way uh, let's go out of here like this and let's go back to my shop and here we are so what we're going to do is we're going to get our green wall and we'll uh yeah we'll build 
In fact, we need some more quartz there. Let's grab that, our nether quartz. Where is it? There it is, quartz block. Uh, let's get rid of that dirt for a minute. And we'll do quartz along the bottom there like that. So that's our window sill. And then we'll do green wool at the bottom here and green wool up the back like that. There we go. And then blue wool above that there like that. And then it'll look a little bit like grass and sky. And then blue wool across the top there like that and then just some more quartz down the sides just to finish it off like so and uh, then we will put oh we should have put redstone lamp in there actually that would have made it look nice let's uh, pop that out the way there um if we take the sky out um wait, i don't have any shears on me so we'll just have to break this the old-fashioned way we'll get a couple of redstone lamps from this chest here uh, have we got any more redstone lights? Yeah, we've got nine, so we've got enough. So we'll put those there, and then we'll just stick a couple of levers on the back of those, and then that way our uh, shop windows will be lit up and they'll look very nice. And then we'll put the glass in front. But before we put the glass in front, we want to put some armor stands on there. So uh, let's do the same thing on this window. So we've got the grass at the bottom, like that, and then the same up the back there, like that, and then some blue wall for the sky there, and then some redstone lamps, uh, one, two, three and then we'll just finish off the walls i've only got one leather quartz block left i'll just go grab another couple of redstone blocks uh not redstone blocks uh quartz blocks quartz quartz normal quartz there we go we have got some more quartz uh and have we got any levers uh we can make a couple of levers I've, oh no i've got loads of levers there absolutely tons of them so uh yeah we can turn those redstone lamps on and hopefully not affect the redstone that we've already done because if i do that um yeah i i think i'll be upset again I'd be very upset uh, so let's hop our way up to the top uh, with some blocks like so no I'm going the wrong way there's no headroom in here that doesn't help that I put that there uh, can we go up there there we go let's hop right up as high as we can come on keep clicking no nope, I'm stuck um, right there place a block there to jump on there we go and if i put a lever on that one there we go that lights them all up perfect so we'll just do the same on the other side get rid of that 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 and uh, let's see if i can hop straight up this time without any mucking about i don't think i'm going to be able to uh, because there's just so much going on in here uh, so one there can i uh, that's that one in the way again there so hop up there move across there um can I pile up from here and do it maybe there we go yep so let's grab that stick that on there and there we go that's our shop windows lit up so now we just need to make some armor stands and I always forget how to make armor stands I think it's pretty much just sticks and uh and um smooth stone so let's give that a go I've got loads of smooth stone in here I haven't got many sticks but I've got plenty of wood uh we don't need the wool anymore we don't need the quartz anymore we don't need the redstone lamps anymore and something's about to get me I'm pretty sure uh where's our wood there we go loads of wood there so we want quite a few armor stands so let's make loads of sticks and uh let's see if we can get this right is it is it like is it like that no uh Okay, well I'm I'm stupid. It's official. Uh, it's one, two, three, four, five, uh, like that. Cause, huh? Um, it's a half slab at the bottom. Okay, yeah, fine. Uh, <laughs> there we go. Let's grab a load of half slabs. Like, let's just make loads of half slabs. There we go, uh, and then we can make loads of armor stands. So, there we go. Um, well, that's 10 armor stands. Uh, yeah, that's that's plenty. So we'll put one in the window facing that way, and one facing that way, and one facing us there. And same with this one here, one there, and there, and there. And then we're going to have a couple in the shop as well. Uh, one there and one there. So as you come into the shop, uh, you'll be able to see them. So now we just need loads and loads of armor. So what are we going to do about making loads of armor? Uh, what armor should we make? I mean, we could make leather, but I haven't got that much leather. Uh, so I'm probably going to go back for doing iron again, uh, only because I've got absolutely loads of iron. And uh, 
it's so easy to get as well. So yeah, let's make a load of iron armor. I suppose I could do some gold. I've got some gold armor kicking about here. There's already some iron armor there, so let's steal that. Um, let's grab that gold chest plate there. And uh, yeah, let's go see what other stuff we've got in here. I know there wasn't much. Uh, there's that chest plate there. Uh, do I have any more gold armor? I'm sure I saw some more gold armor earlier. Um, no, have I got any in my bedroom or in my ender chest? I might have. It's not impossible. Uh, none in my ender chest. None in there and none in there. What about in my enchantment room? Oh, I can show you all my enchanted books as well. Look at all that. No, and oh, I've got a diamond chest plate, so we'll use that. Um, yeah, so let's go start and dress in some armor stands. And uh, did I get some iron? No, I didn't get any iron. Nope. Let's go back in here. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's grab, there we go. Look, I've got loads of iron. I've got quite a lot of gold as well. So let's grab some gold and let's grab some diamond. We'll, we'll make all sorts of different armors. And uh, yeah, we can have a bit of a mix and match. That'll look nice, I think. So uh, it's going to be a bit of a waste of resources because uh, the armor I've got, I'm probably never going to change. I'm just going to keep repairing it. But um, I think it's worth it. I think it'll look nice. So let's make a load of gold uh, and let's have a gold hat uh, there and some gold boots like that and some gold leggings like that and let's uh, let's grab a load more iron and we'll do most of it in iron just because we've got so much of it so let's like make three more hats and three more chest plates uh, like so there we go and three more pairs of leggings like so and uh, three more pairs of boots obviously like so. Right, now our inventory is full, so let's start going and dressing these uh, armor stands. So we'll put uh, that on there and that on there. And he can have a hat and some boots, like that. And we'll do the same on the other window, like this. Uh, so uh, ch -ch -ch hat and boots and chest plate and leggings. There we go. And we'll stick the same things on one of these ones. One of these can be iron as well, just because we've got more iron than anything else. Um, there we go, and a hat and some boots for you, sir. There we go, and on this one, this can, can be gold, because it's nice inside. It looked very nice as a gold one. There we go, some trousers and some boots for you. Uh, and let's make one of these ones a bit of a mix and match. What have we, oh, we've got not a late, great deal left. We've got, uh, we need a hat, so let's go make, we'll put a diamond chest plate on him, um, and we'll put uh, iron trousers on. We'll put this uh, diamond hat on him. Uh, we'll put the diamond boots on him. We'll put the iron boots on him. We'll put him a diamond hat on as well. Uh, so what we've got, leggings. He can have iron leggings. Um, and that's that window done. So let's put the glass in front of there like that. There we go. So then we just need to finish this one off. So all we need is a complete other set and some leggings. And all we've got is boots. There we go. So that's it. The, don't look quite as fancy as the ones on the other side but it's good enough so they can stay in there and that uh, there we go that's my little armor shop so I've only got one little bit to do now which is um, just to finish off the top bit and what we're gonna do here is we're gonna have a couple of um, pillars one two three four like that and one here one two three four like that and then we're gonna have a nice roof on it uh, and it's just gonna be a bit of a canopy really just uh, to make it look a little bit more posh so this is my very very posh and expensive armor shop which has actually cost me a lot in resources so uh, just when you think you don't need to go mining for a while all of a sudden you need to go mining again uh, but not to worry it's all good fun I mean that's what we play this for isn't it we go mining for the resources and so we can use them uh, it'd be pretty boring if we got all of those resources and never used any of them have I got any more stairs so I can do some nice stairs or shall I just yeah I want it I want it with stairs uh, I can't change that back can I I don't think I'm gonna have enough quartz to finish off doing the stairs hmm it's a risky it's a risky move 16 no I might get the front done one two three oh four I just need a little bit more quartz um, I've got 11 left. One, two, three, four, five. I'm going to make it. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. And one, two, three, 
four, five. And if I had two more, that would be amazing, but I've only got one. So we'll leave that like that. I think that looks okay. Um, yeah, that looks fine. So there we go. That's our fancy armor shop. Absolutely, 100% complete so uh, yeah let's fill in that little bit of ground there and let's go in oh phew, he says shutting the door on the way in and let's have a look on the inside so we've got a nice glass roof and uh, yeah so we can go in there and get some armor on but we've already got uh, plenty of armor on so we don't actually need to use it but there we go completely done so uh, yeah thank you all very much for watching and i will see you all in the next video bye